Hello AI enthusiasts, are you ready to dive into the world of Manus, the autonomous AI agent that's currently shaking up the tech scene? In this video, I'll show you everything you need to know about Manus, what it can do, how it works, why it's so special, and what discussions it's generating. Grab something to drink, sit back, and let's get started. It's going to be a wild ride through the future of artificial intelligence. Imagine having a digital assistant that not only answers your questions, but also takes on complex tasks for you completely independently. This is Manus, developed by the Chinese company Monica, and it's considered one of the most advanced AI agents currently being developed. Why is it causing such a stir? Because Manus doesn't just generate ideas, it implements them. Whether it's creating a website, planning a trip, or conducting a stock analysis, Manus does it for you step by step without you having to constantly intervene. Let's look at what such advanced AI agents like Manus could accomplish in the near future. For example, you need a presentation on the law of momentum for your class. An autonomous agent could research, collect images, write the text, and ultimately deliver a finished presentation that you can use right away. Or you want to travel to Japan and need a detailed plan. An advanced AI agent could create a complete seven-day itinerary, including daily activities, flight options, and a cost overview. It would search the internet, find the best options, and present you with a finished plan. How does something like this work? The most advanced AI agents use what's called a multi-agent architecture. You can think of it as a team of specialists. One member plans the task, another executes it, and a third checks the results. Think of an orchestra with different instruments playing a harmonious piece together. These agents typically run in a virtual environment, comparable to a computer within a computer, and have access to tools such as web browsers, code interpreters, and databases. Imagine you upload a CSV file with product prices and tell the agent, analyze this data and create a presentation for my meeting tomorrow. It would open the file, process the data, identify trends, create informative graphics, and put together a complete presentation. This isn't just a simple chatbot that only returns text to you. It's more like a digital employee who completes entire workflows for you. How good could this be? AI research is advancing rapidly. The most powerful agents are performing better and better in benchmarks like GAIA. That's a test that measures how well AI can solve real problems. In demonstrations, you can see how such agents perform complex tasks like stock analysis. They obtain financial data, check market sentiment, create insightful charts, and summarize everything in a structured report. These capabilities could be revolutionary. Of course, there are also challenges. Data protection is a major issue. If an AI agent autonomously browses the internet, what about the security of your data? This question concerns many experts and users alike. Then there's reliability. Even the most advanced systems can make mistakes. For instance, when creating a website where build errors can occur that require human intervention, and sometimes such systems can get stuck in loops, like when searching for images for a presentation where they can't move forward. Nevertheless, the possibilities are impressive. Imagine automating routine tasks in your daily work, whether it's B2B research, data analysis for your online shop, or screening applications. Such AI assistance could enormously increase your productivity. In a hypothetical example, an agent could filter New York real estate according to your budget, safety criteria, and school quality, including a Python script for the complex calculations. Or it could create an interactive website with stock data that can be published online. The versatility of such systems is fascinating. They could, for example, create a biography by gathering information from various sources, writing the text, and even developing a website for it, all autonomously. Or they could plan a trip to San Francisco by analyzing crime data, identifying safe neighborhoods, and creating a detailed travel plan with activities and budget. For educational institutions, they could develop course materials by researching and structuring relevant content. Another example, an AI agent could perform a correlation analysis between different stocks. It would access reliable data sources, validate the information, write Python code for analysis and visualization, and even create an interactive website to present the results. Or it could compile a list of B2B companies from a specific startup batch by browsing relevant websites and filtering the information, a task that would take hours manually. There are also creative uses. AI agents could design sound effects. For example, a short mix of nature sounds for a project. Or they could develop interactive websites for role-playing games with various scenarios and decision trees. This versatility makes such technologies particularly valuable. From analytical to creative tasks, they could cover a broad spectrum. But there are also dark sides that we should not ignore. 
Jobs could change or disappear if AI takes over such tasks. Ethical questions arise. Who bears responsibility if an AI agent makes erroneous decisions? How can we ensure that the results are fair and unbiased? And then there are security risks. If agents act independently on the internet, security gaps could emerge. Nevertheless, the development of such technologies is advancing. Startups and established companies are investing massively in this area. With new releases, demand is often so great that servers are overloaded. The demos speak for themselves. AI agents that unpack files, review resumes, write code, and deliver usable results. These are no longer theoretical concepts, but becoming reality. A particularly interesting aspect is the ability of these systems to adapt to user preferences. If, for example, you prefer tables to long text, they could remember this and present future results accordingly. This shows that modern AI not only completes tasks, but also learns and adapts to individual needs. The open source movement in this area is also exciting. Many developers are working on freely accessible versions of such agents that anyone can run on their own computer. With some technical know-how, you could install such systems and use them for personal tasks. From travel planning to stock analysis. This gives a taste of the future. What makes this new generation of AI assistants so special? Is the step from generating ideas to delivering results. While many language models stay with text and concepts, these agents go further and implement ideas. They show how far AI development has already come and where it might be moving towards a more comprehensive artificial intelligence that can act not only in a specific area, but across domains. The discussions are diverse. Some experts argue that these are just clever combinations of existing technologies. Not a fundamental breakthrough. Others doubt the scalability due to server bottlenecks and limited access possibilities. But the trends speak clearly. More and more companies are betting on AI agents and analysts predict enormous growth in the coming years. Back to the challenges. The ethical and technical safety concerns deserve our attention. If AI agents act autonomously on the internet, they could inadvertently disclose sensitive data or uncover security vulnerabilities. Additionally, there's the risk of biases and erroneous information if the underlying data isn't balanced. These risks require transparent practices and appropriate regulations. So what do you think? Are we at the beginning of a new era of AI assistance? Or are we seeing just another overrated tool with obvious risks? I'm curious about your opinion in the comments. If you like this update, leave a like and subscribe to the channel. And if you activate the bell, you'll even be informed when we upload a new video. I hope to see you next time. Until then, stay real.